In this video, I'll show you how to use the scanner of your Canon PIXMA MJ3620. I'll show you how to use it directly just by pressing a few buttons without connecting to any devices, but I'll also show you how to use it with a PC computer. In case you want to send the scan by email or just to keep it in your files on your computer. So let's start with the easiest way to scan. First thing, just make sure that you have some paper inserted in the paper tray okay like this open the scanner place the document here i have a document align it with this corner over here you should see a small arrow pointing so you just need to glide it until it touches this corner then close down this lid and then you have to select if you want a black and white the first button here or a color scan it will then take one of this piece of paper and it will print whatever scan it just scanned on that paper. In my case, I want a, a black and white, so I'll press the black button here once. You just have to wait at this point. Perfect. So this is our scan, just to show you, compare to the original one. As I asked, I want it in black and white, and this is how it looks. Now let me show you how to do it with a PC Windows computer. You need to download the software uh, from the Canon website, the driver for the printer, so it works with your PC. Just make sure that Windows is selected here. By the way, I'll put this link in the description of this video, so it's easier for you and then press the download, download it and open the software. Open the software that you just downloaded. Yes. Start setup. Select your country and region, then press next. Press yes. Agree. Next. And here it will ask you if you want to connect by wireless or by USB connection. We want to do it wirelessly. So select that one and press next. Select the first one. And now it's time to go on the printer and put it in pairing mode. You need to press once on the stop button. Then here that's the network button. You're going to keep it pressed until this light will blink. Then you can release it. Press the color button, this button over here once, and then the network button once as well, until this light is flashing. Then press the next button on the computer. Then press next here. Okay, then make sure that your printer is selected on this list and press next. And then you'll have connection completed. This is nice. You're going to press next. A lot of next buttons. And now you have to wait. Then it will ask you to do a print head alignment to do so make sure that you have paper inserted in the printer itself okay and just press the next button and then you can press the execute button if you want it to print the test sheet to align the print head but you can skip this process you're not obligated to do it so you can press next if you want to skip it And it will give you the message that the setup is finally completed and you can press next here it will ask you which software you want it to be installed and honestly you don't need any of these 
So you can click back to top and exit this uh, software. Now you're going to go in the start button here of your Windows computer. Whoop, click on it. Then go into the settings. Then go in device. Then printer and scanners. Then tap the plus icon here. And the Canon printer should appear in this list, MJ3600 series. Click on it. Click Add Device. And wait until it's connected. It's connecting right now. Then you should see appear over here your Canon printer under Printer and Scanners. You should see two of them. This is the one you need to click with WS if you want to scan. Click on it. Click Manage. And then from here you can select the scanner if you want to scan. You can tap Open Scanner. If you don't see this, it will ask you to download the scan app that is from Windows. Download it and then you'll be able to see this button appearing. Now, if you want to scan with your Windows laptop, you just need to open the scanner here. Take any document that you want to scan and place it facing down and align it with the arrow that is right over here. So just push it until it reach that corner like this. Then close the lid. And on your PC, you're going to tap the scan button. And after a few seconds, you're going to get this message that scan blah, 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 PNG was saved on to desktop. So you can go to the desktop. You can go view directly here, or you can simply close everything. And on my desktop over there, I can already see it. Let me open it. This is the scan I just did. Then you can adjust it, rotate it, send it by email, do whatever you want to do. Thanks for watching. I hope this was useful. Please leave a like, a comment down below if you want to support this channel. And I'll see you in the next one.